All right, so I don't know if anyone has heard this or not, but the, apparently the the voice actor Justin Roiland of Rick and Morty has been fired. So they're currently looking for another voice actor to take on take on the job, and apparently uh, they haven't they they said they haven't found one yet, but they're working, they're searching for an actor, a voice actor for the role. So uh, yeah. That's the, the the thing is though, uh, wasn't he uh like acquitted or whatever? Wasn't he like? Didn't he get like the the charges dropped? Yeah, I think he did. I think he got the charges dropped, and but yet they still fired him from all of his roles because that's the way things go now. Even if you're innocent, they just remove you. I think it's mostly because he might have said some certain things that were related to conspiracy theories throughout the show and told some truth. I mean, I did uh, well, I'll let the person that is doing the voices right now talk about it. Go ahead, tell what you gotta say. Go ahead and talk, a little bit, whatever. You know, take, take the, take the lead, go ahead. Jeez, are you gonna talk, or not? Yeah, I really think personally what, what, what it is, is that he said certain things that didn't go along with the agenda out there so they did not they didn't they didn't uh, they weren't really on board with it I think that's what it was a lot of it so personally that's what I think and uh, that's pretty much that's my thoughts on it now, I don't agree with everything he has to say about, like, God and and Jesus, because personally, you know, that's my personal belief, but I do enjoy the sci-fi aspect of the show and a lot of truth that's hidden in the show and a lot of um, interdimensional and mul or multi-dimensional multiple realities. I really do enjoy that particular aspect of the show. I don't know what that noise was, but in the background. Anyway, ignore any, ignore any sounds. But yeah, that's my thoughts. Alright, yeah, so remember like when Rick said uh, to the President of the United States, Rick said, uh, what, 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 is a, what is a terrorist at this point, Mr. President? Just, just someone that you don't like? Yeah, that was one. That was probably one. And also, what about the one on the 9-11 sketch? The 9-11 the part with uh, the, the guy that played Richard Castle? Uh, Nathan Fillion? Uh, he, he was on there and he said, uh, when he said, uh, it was an excuse that took away our freedom. Remember, remember that one? Yeah, yeah, I remember that one as well. Where the, we're looking inside Rick's memories and we see that particular scene take place. And they, they brought up 9-11. And there's several other things in there too. About controlled societies and, and things like that that are also relevant in society today so I think that may be why that they fired truthfully truth be told why they fired the main creative mind behind the show but that's just my thoughts all right so who do you think will take over the role of Rick and Morty wibble a dub dub oh geez I guess we're gone Give your thoughts in the comment section below. Like, subscribe, share, and don't forget to, um, what else do you do? What else do you want to do on YouTube? There's just liking, share, subscribe. Put your comments below and, uh... Yeah, pretty much. That's, that's, that's my thoughts on what happened. Yep, that's my thoughts. That's my thoughts as well. Too much truth, right? Too much truth. Yep. They wanted to go in a different creative direction, I'm sure. But if someone's proven innocent, how are they still... How are they still banned from everything? It seems that you're, 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 you're guilty until proven innocent. And then even if you're proven innocent, if they don't like something you've said, you're still guilty. Yeah, that's pretty much the way it is now. Alright, I'm gone. That's all. Hey, here's an idea. What about me?
Yeah, you know, I'm doing both voices right now. Yeah, that's that's a good idea. Let's get on that. Yeah, let's do that.